In April 2023, Trinidad and Tobago joined the United Nations Women, Peace and Security Focal Points Network. Minister with Responsibility for Gender and Child Affairs, Ayanna Webster-Roy, earlier this month led a delegation to Washington for the fifth capital meeting of the network. We are in the process of adapting this framework to Trinidad and Tobago's context, keeping in mind our society's unique needs and capacities. We look forward to your active participation as we collect your feedback and suggestions to draft our first WPS National Action Plan. Identify key players in this process and then implement it. Meanwhile, National Security Minister Fitzgerald Hines says he has seen firsthand while engaging with women in his community, the effects our escalating crime rate has on women and girls. Women are the worst afflicted and the worst sufferers from any type of upheaval, whether it's climate change, whether it is civil strife, Whatever is the nature of the problem, our women are the ones, the women of the world are the ones who bear the heavier burdens. Minister Webster Roy points out she grew up in an area in Tobago that traditionally was crime-free. But the area has seen drive-by shootings and gun crimes in recent years. Today, I ask you to consider the application of the WPS agenda in addressing issues such as gun and gang violence, domestic violence, climate change, health crises, and other challenges that we grapple with as a nation on an ongoing basis. The minister indicates by strategically placing women in leadership roles in our efforts to address these issues, the country will benefit from their unique input. The ministers were speaking at the opening ceremony of a workshop to implement a Women, Peace and Security National Action Plan. Terry Ann Brown Campbell, TTT News.